Make sure you watch this entire video, absolutely free game breakdown. Now, the Thursday night game I gave, I gave out, I said I was treading lightly. This game, no light treading. I'm going heavy on this one. As of right now, this is my favorite game of the week. That could change, but as of right now, this is my favorite game of the week. Make sure you subscribe to this channel. Turn those notifications on. Hit that like button. Leave us a comment. Become part of that comment crew. I'm still doing the 20 comments, and we get a t-shirt winner for our favorite comment. Could be a funny comment. Could be some good insight into the game. Could be some good insight into another game. It doesn't really matter. We just want some quality comments, and we will reward the winner we gave out a lot of t-shirts last year we're having a little bit of a slow start this year so let's pick that up guys now let me dig into this game i am looking at the utah versus oregon state game this is a game where you have two top 25 ranked pack 12 teams probably the best conference in football right now the utes come into this game defeating ucla 14 to 7 it was not an impressive defeat for me. They had uh, they opened the game up with a 75-yard. Uh, I'm sorry, they opened the game up with a pick six, and that's that's where one of their touchdowns came from. So they only had one offensive touchdown. Cam Rising is still questionable. Uh, their defense is really strong, but they have no offense at all. I mean, their 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 backup quarterback is managing at, at best. Uh, their top two running backs are both out. One's out for the year. One's questionable for this game. It's looking like he's not going to start. Their top tight end is not starting. They really don't have much of an offense right now. Defensively, like I said, they're sixth in the league. I mean, they're very good. They're allowing an average of 10 points a game. Really solid defense. But they have not really faced someone like DJ Ugalele yet. Yes, Dante Moore is okay, but DJ Ugalele is a little bit better in, in our opinion here. Oregon State lost to Washington State 38 to 35 they they started down big and they made a comeback here's the problem though <clears throat> washington state's quarterback cam ward he's lights out he's very very good he has 1400 yards in the year 80 percent completion 13 touchdowns no interceptions oregon state doesn't have to face a quarter like a quarterback like that in this game they have to face a a second string quarterback at best even if cam rising does come back in it's going to be a it's going to be an it, Tread a little bit more lightly if Cam Rising is announced a starter in this game. But even if he does come back in, it's his first game back. He's had an ACL injury since last January, so we'll see what happens there. Um, defensively, they're a little bit middle of the pack. But like I said, even though Utah has won eight of these last ten matchups between these two teams, their offense is so limited right now, we expect Oregon State to slow down the game, rely on the rushing game, rely on uh, DJ Ugalele to get the job done, Utah has no passing game right now, so that's nothing to worry about. This is a Beavers money line, Oregon State money line pick all day. The best price that I'm seeing is minus 145 on Bet MGM. Lock this one in. And remember, hit that uh, notification button, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and leave us a comment. Become part of that comment crew. We got a lot more games coming for you this weekend. This is just the beginning of it. Love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow for more football breakdowns.